sleeping in my lap. Rip, 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 side of the window, diamonds bright like a lamb. What's good, all my YouTube family, friends, etc. How y'all doing? Hopefully, y'all blessed, never stressed. It's your boy MULA, Mula Mika, yeah, that's me. And uh, this is gonna be my second time. I'm gonna do a YouTube review snack, exotic snack review again. Cause the first one hit 1K with no problem, and everybody seemed to love the content. So, I'm gonna get to it and dig right on in. I was making a couple pit stops at a couple of stores and I seen some, some more exotic snacks so I wanted to try them with y'all and share the results. But uh, anyways, let's dig in, see what I got for y'all. I'm gonna show y'all what I got first of all. And uh, if you ever tried this stuff, I mean, make sure to drop a comment below, give me a thumbs up, share. I highly appreciate that. You know, for showing much love. And, uh, anyways, let's talk and let me show you what I got, the products that I got. Let's, let's get right to it. You feel me? But the first one, I'm going to show you the, the one that I might not really like. I ain't going to lie. I ain't going to say might not, but I most highly won't like it. But I just got it just to do a review because it'd probably be fun, I mean. But, uh, this one right here, it... When I grabbed it, I grabbed it on some fast jump. And without looking, I just knew it was made in China and I knew it was an exotic snack. Man, on the back though, guess what it is, y'all? Hold up one time. This is octopus balls. This octopus balls. The flavor of octopus balls. That's crazy. Paws. Octopus balls, paws. Hold on. That's crazy. I don't even know if I really want to try that now. That's crazy. But then we got this one. This one gotta be busting. This the fried crab. Definitely had to pick up those. I was like, yeah, those definitely gotta be hitting. You feel me? Especially on some munchy junk after you know medicating yourself and getting yourself together. You feel me? You gonna get hungry, of course. But then we got the Skittles from China. And then I was out traveling, like I said, out there in New Mexico or whatever. And I picked up these cigars. These drinks are expensive as heck, man. I wanted to say, I wanted to curse, but let me fix my language. But yeah, these drinks are expensive as heck. These are called cigars. As you see the price. You feel me? 66.24. This is chocolate. Only come with three in it. So this is not your everyday snack. So I wanted to see how these is. I'm going to throw these in there. You feel me? This is not the everyday thing. So it's technically exotic. You feel me? So let's get that going. Should I say the best for last or the worst for last? Mm hmm Dang. I think I might want to get that worst one right up out the way. Yeah. There you go. We're going to go for the octopus balls. I know these cannot be that good. Octopus balls, pause. Hold on. Alright. So now the first one we're going to try this is probably the nastiest one. Like, most likely guaranteed. These are the Spring Limited Edition. Now, how dare you? The spring Limited Edition. Oh, man, that's crazy. They better be limited. The octopus balls pause, man. Come on, man. They gotta be limited. Let's see what's going on. Boy, I hope these ain't nasty, man. I do not want to regurgitate on camera. Bag tough as heck. Tough as now. Hmm. It smells kind of crazy. Y'all see that? This is natural. Let's try the smallest one.
<laughs> One out of ten. <clears throat> Woo. One out of ten. This is a freaking two or one. It tasted good at first. Then all of a sudden this kick came in crazy. I ain't gonna lie to you. Mm-mm, man. I don't know, man. I don't know. Everybody got different taste buds, but me personally, if you got piggy taste buds like me, don't ever buy these. Don't waste your money. Mm -hmm. No. That's crazy. <laughs> All right. Let's move on to the next one, though. Crab, I ain't gonna lie to you. No lie. You ever tried these before? Drop a comment below once again. This actually tastes like fried crab. That's crazy. These junks is actually good as heck. If you love seafood and you love crab legs, go the cheap way out. Get you some chips, some fried crab leg lays, you feel me? You know, it's gonna at least suit your appetite and the taste for it, you feel me? You'll be alright, you'll be satisfied. You not bad. I ain't gonna lie to you. This is what at least do the job for you. If you got the taste for crab legs and you just ain't got the money, these will do the job. No lie. Tastes like real crab legs. One out of ten? I'm gonna get these ten. For sure. For shit sure. Alright. Well, I said I was gonna do the Skittles. Right. Let's see what's going on. Smell like your average Skittles. Look like the average Skittles. These are busting. Excuse me. One out of ten. These are ten too. I ain't gonna lie to you. They like sour. Without the powder on them. It almost says like sour starburst in the middle. I know it's a skittle, but I don't know. That joint tastes crazy. It's good though. I ain't gonna lie to you. I will buy this again. Crab legs again. Last but not least, we got the cigars. But hold on, let me finish. 
I got like four more Skittles. I gotta finish these. These junks is definitely good. For sure. We can throw all the flavors in there all at once. We can eat them all at once. That junk go crazy. All right, now for the 66.24 price chocolate cigars. Let's see what these hitting for. That joint actually look realistic, like a real cigar. Crazy, right? If you know me, I don't really eat chocolate like that, but when I went to that shop in New Mexico, she was giving out samples, and that chocolate was hit, and it was amazing. I ain't gonna lie, high quality chocolate, so let's see what this do. If this is just as good or what, or is it overpriced? Not bad. It's good. It's good. I ain't gonna lie. That junk melt in your mouth. That's your girl. She know I do too. This junk melt in your mouth. That's your girl. She know I do too. You heard? It's stronger though. One out of ten. It's a ten. If you ever had this too, of course, drop your comment below. Let me know your your personal opinion of any of these exotic snacks. Most definitely good. All right. Now, if I had to say which one is the best out of all of them, I ain't gonna lie. Y'all know I love seafood. I love Skittles. If you know me, you know me. If you don't, now you know. I love seafood. I definitely love Skittles. So, personally, if I had to do from the best to worst, i say Skittles. The Skittles won. They won. They number one. Um... The fried crab leg lays. He's most definitely number two. And only because I don't really care for too much chocolate because I am chocolate myself. So I got a whole bunch of it on me daily. So, you know, I'm used to it on the average on the average day. Uh, I'm going to place these third. That's the only reason why. But most chocolate lovers, you know, if y'all was to taste these, y'all would probably put these first, you know, but 
I don't really care for chocolate too much because I got, once again, a lot of chocolate on me. <laughs> but uh, these most definitely, these bad boys, this is something that, you know, I'm not trying to violate, you know, China or, you know, the manufacturers or anything like that. Lay's company itself or, or, or get a strike on YouTube for saying this, but these right here, personally, is something that I give, I will give to my dog down here, you know, because he likes chewing on stuff anyways. As you see, he's trying to chew on his, on his uh, leash, but he smells them. The octopus balls, the octopus balls, paws, he smells them. I think that we go ahead and we go ahead and give him these. Make sure you go online and shop with my brand. It's called Joko Denim. That's D-R-O-C-O -O space D-E-N-I-M. Joko Denim once again. Um, I got shoes on there, handmade out of Italy. The same quality as Prada, Gucci, etc. Whatever you want to name it. Handmade out of Italy from the finest Italian shoemakers in the game. 20 years minimum doing this job alone. So make sure you tap in. That's on Google. You can Google the brand. Uh, I got new music, new videos dropping, and also new YouTube content. I might even do a podcast, do my first interview or whatever. But that's my second YouTube review other than my music and stuff. Uh, and it's only the beginning. It's only going to get better and better, you heard? But uh, y'all stay dangerous out there, man. Just stay alert. You know, it's a war out here in this world. Man, in order to succeed, you got to be successful. In order to be successful, you must succeed. I said it first, you know. That's my saying. That's my little moral. But I'm out of here, though, man.